Yo, GameBro here, and this is Let's Play Yoshi's Island. This really should never not be called Super Mario World 2. It's almost nothing like the first game. Um, but anywho's um, I got a hundred percent on that last level I did, the Castle One Slime Boss. Um, it was just stars I was lacking, so I didn't show it off. On the other hand, if there will be um coins or flowers I'm missing, I will show off what I missed. Um, but otherwise, I feel to see the point in re-recording that level. So yeah, we got extra and bonus. Perhaps a lot of people would prefer to wait until the game's complete to do these, but you know what? My choice, I'm gonna show these off once I unlock them. Poochie ain't stupid. Or is it? Um. And the bonus stuff that is, um, like mini games, you can play them as many times as you wish. And I don't know why I thought before that this game saves you lives. I mean, the Game Advanced version does, but like m most SNES games, don't seem to bother with. Um, you have to recollect the lives once you turn off the power. I don't know what I was, what I was thinking. I really can be naive at times. Um, and there's Poochie. See how intelligent that dog is. Wherever you're facing on it, um, is where it'll be going. Oops, um, get down here. That was too close. I'm probably gonna have to retry. Uh, and is that my first death? Um, if it is, well, there you go. Damn dog, um, okay, don't go too far off, um, it'll be side-scrolling after the first few steps, get some eggs, because we can, why the hell not? Most things in this game won't instantly kill you, um, but we'll have baby Mario just floating away from you, you have to get him before the toadies come to steal him. But, um, lava, magma, thorns, those are instant death, no matter, um, how long you have to save baby Mario, you just die, simple as that. <laughs> okay, come on, doggy, come on. Boing! Careful, careful. But the the secret levels I mentioned on the Game Advance version, on the other hand, I will show those after I've completed the SNES version. Because I have stated I don't have a GameCube and GPA um, Game Boy player to be able to record properly. And I'm not one to use emulators, plus truth be told I still not, do not have internet. But I should begin in a few days um, as I am recording this. Just don't miss anything. There's no way you can go back. I was worried for a second, not gonna lie. Ah. Get those, it's troublesome. It was just stars anyway. It's about the end of the level. I was about to say, this is goodbye for Bucci. And I missed a couple. Oh crap. Editing will be required. I don't... I don't remember which ones I'm missing. I said I spent like hundreds of hours in this game. Even after not playing for a while, you still think I would... Still be well aware. I've completed this game 100% so many times. Well, I guess I'll have to be recording and I will... Well, I'd like to show off this bonus game. I think we've seen this before, but you know what? Why not? 
Let's get a few items. One thing in the game does save though is like these items you collect. So the game is at least nice enough in that part. One more. Damn it. Damn it. Doggone Kamek. Well, I'll be right back. It's not like they're hidden and whatnot. Okay, we're almost done with this once again. Don't you dare screw me up, Poochie. Alright. Later. Again, Poochie. And there are two green Yoshis for some reason. And now with the perfect score, I can finally move on to World 2. Again, this is quite a long game. So, um, this one has a Koopa Troopa on it. Let's hope my memory does not fail me again. Where's the Koopa? And Paracoopa, or Paratroopa, it should be called. Some enemies you cannot just swallow, even though you can, um, pretty much to begin with. You have to pop them out of their shells first. That's one of the few things that has a common with Super Mario World. Oh boy, this is fun. This is a lot of fun. No sarcasm. First, touch a superstar and become powerful Mario. Hold left or right on pad, you can run up a wall and across the ceiling. Hold B to float and hold Y to dash. I mean it, no sarcasm, these are a lot of fun. You are invincible, you are speedy, and this is just a blast to play through as. In fact, I'm half tempted to try to collect all those coins. I used to like, go around this stuff over and over again because um, these are like the best sections in the game. We play as Mario. I get it. Yes, I'm gonna collect all those coins because. Just because. And those less ones. It's just the exit. Um, good thing those stars keep responding over and over again. Sadly, there aren't many sections like these um, in the game. I just want to make sure there's some, that there's nothing down there. I'm going to assume not. It's just an exit for if you fail to say it's Super Baby Mario. So I'm going to call him Super Baby Mario. Be careful, you could fall to your death here. Yeah. Oh, wait. That was just a one up. No, I'm dead. Goodbye, cruel world. That means I'll have to. Man, I am not doing very good this time. I'll have to redo that baby section again. So, screw those coins. None of them are red, anyways. I'm just gonna get this over with. As much as I enjoy this stuff. You think like you'd be able to. Throw eggs with that huge one following you, but nope. You just run up walls. Fast-paced, um, Sonic-like gameplay. And no, you can't leave a Super Baby Mario. There are only so many sections of this game. It's too bad, because, again, they are a lot of fun. That's a one-up. But could have just done that to begin with. About that, um, Koopa Shell. Down the pipe. And Poochie again. Now it's me mentioned that that dog's name is Poochie. We're like, even the, the designers, um, like, kind of encouraging the players to wait for the extra stuff. Until he beat the game. Because it's like we met Poochie before. From that extra level. Oh man, that was close. Those spikes are instant death. 
I'm not sure if this key's required or just for minigame, but... She'll find out for too long. Later, Poochie. For reals. This time. Up we go. This part is a little tricky. Besides having to avoid getting crushed. Um, like I almost just was. You have some coins you could try to... Red coins here that you need to be careful not to miss. I believe there's like one, even one flower that you need to be careful of not missing. Ah. Those things are in the way of those of red coins, right? I don't want to have to re-go through these levels. I don't think I picked up any red coins, so if I did miss a few coins, um, surely they're just the plain old yellow ones. And there's one more missed. else here so let us get to move on I guess ground pound ground pound ground pound nope not one of those pipes you can enter and deadly balloons they drop things No, I... I thought I pushed up. Well, um... No... I really should have tried to, from that minigame, get one of those star items, because I may have screwed myself over. Could have thrown an egg, but, um... not required and I'm generally quick enough there you go that's all the flowers still missing six of them red coins very good very good before you can exit popping balloons these are always fun No. Ah, uh, but duh. I forgot about this luck game as well. It's kind of a hard time ground pounding than what I thought. It would have been a bit time consuming having to keep missing it, possibly. But that one ended up having to be the one I need to pop. Oh well. Thankfully, I get. To get stars, um, enough stars. So. Slot machine. There are six mini games in this. Um, this one's definitely my least favorite, being the most difficult to get lives for. Not that I really need them, but you know, why wouldn't you want to pick up lives if you can? With cut footage, um, it's gonna be a short video, so I'm gonna do one more quickly. The baseball boys. See, so I just jump on them. Throwing eggs will be completely useless, although you can use help for getting um red coins and whatnot. By pitchers and batters, gimmick for level, I guess. Although they do appear in a few others, passing by those enemies that remind me of Kirby, but don't suck you up. 
one of the least threatening enemies in the game. Like, even more so than these shy guys. Because they just walk slowly. They don't really... They don't have any tricks up their sleeves and whatnot. They're just really easy enemies. Yeah, I shouldn't... And I forgot there was a mini Mario section. Okay, quit your crying. I got you. I got you. It's pretty easy to get Baby Mario back if you lose him. Um, I mean, it doesn't fall off too far, but... Still, um, be careful. What can I say? What does this... Block have to say? Super! Yes, uh, did it really need to be explained? We went through that. But, um, it's this way, um, I probably shouldn't go. Nope, I can't go this way. Those are instant kill. You can't, like, cheat your way through it. Well, I can't really say cheat, um, but. Per se. So you have to get that star anyway. Which I can't complain. Run, 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 run. Run like no tomorrow. So much fun, as I've stated. Still had plenty of time there. That was quite easy. <laughs> Take this! Pause the thing of the pictures you can, um, sometimes get some eggs from them. Let's go to an angle, shoot the right time. Okay, that wasn't a star, um, I mean, not star, flower. <laughs> really now. And those ice melon freezing enemies, as you can see. They're, they're not really useful, they're just kind of fun to use, I guess. I mean, there are a few things they're useful for, but not many. You can also collect, like, items of them, super versions that you can... We can blow out ice nine times as opposed to three. Because it's like no hidden world, it's just. Kind of, a, kind of an odd place to put a. Well, I mean, I guess it's not really odd since it's required, I guess. A slight annoyance that you have to freeze for a bit. When you head, like, you know what I'm trying to say. I believe we head down this way first, and some more of these. I mean, they do save you from using eggs, although there are enemies that you can just um. No, I don't think I need to go this way first. Heading up. Wonderful. Just effing wonderful. How am I doing? Um, I guess I still got a ways to go. I guess it's gonna be a long part. Friggin' chain jumps and uh, chain jumps, piranha plants. What's wrong with me? Why am I so slow-witted? And another transformation. I think we... seen this once before. Okay, um... Hurry now, hurry now. Here you go. Where I got the 
Red coins required. So, yep. Was there, a, but was there a limited chances anyway? Nope. That could be the last of the stars I could get. So, be careful. Devouring. And another one over there. You can only um, destroy those with eggs if you knock some against each other. Yeah, this is a little long. Even a lot of layer stuff don't does not take this long to complete. We're doing. I need one more coin, and if that's the case, I'm I probably missed it somewhere. Down, down, down. Where the arrows lead. Why don't these blocks appear earlier to, um, explain? Because we've been through these on... We've seen these on the freaking first level, for crying out loud. And the picture. Very good, very good. Just need one more flower and I am good. No, 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 no. F you. F you. Throw these at an angle. These are always fun. It's like billiards, as I have stated. Head for the goal! Finish! How nice to end this with a bonus game. Dun 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 dun! This is the quickest mini game. Yeah, this is all you do. It takes like a single second to finish. Well, this is the end for this part. This is Game Bro. See you all in the next video.